ABS is great for the street, but you'll want to turn it off for the off-road work, cause you can't make flat track turns if you can't spin that rear wheel. Now for the drivetrain that Triumph hinges its mid-size cruiser hopes upon, the 900cc twin. This modern power plant runs a single overhead cam to time the 8-valve head, and a water jacket that both carries off-waste heat and acts as a sound dampener for the threshing noises inside the cases. Although the 84.6mm bore and 80mm stroke is arranged in the traditional parallel twin configuration, it comes with a 270-degree offset in the crank that gives the engine a lope at idle that you simply can't get from one of the old. 180 degree twin mill engine. Slightly over square, the mill has a predictably torquey nature with a solid, 59 pound feet of grunt at an incredibly low, 2850 revolutions per minute. That comes backed up by 55 ponies at 6000 revolutions per minute, and the power delivery is rather linear for a manageable temperament that won't really surprise you or get away from you without deliberate provocation. Compression is a little on the warm side at 10.55 to 1, so you will need the mid-grade pump to prevent pre-ignition slash detonation slash dieseling. Arrive by